Lauren and in today's video I will be showing you how I created this fun light up card using the cozy fireplace stamp set along with the easy light one light from pear blossom press so I've already um, stamped and cut and colored my images and to create a background I'm using a brick stencil spritzing my white cardstock lightly and then sending the stencil with the cardstock through my embossing machine or my die cutting machine with my embossing plates and then to create the sentiment I am inking it up and stamping it onto this banner and it's a really cute sentiment it says wishing you warmth love and happiness this holiday season and so I've cut my brick background down to four and a quarter by five and a half. And then I add a black frame that I have die cut, a uh, scalloped frame from my stash. And I adhere that onto the brick background as well. And then I'm adhering my sentiment on. And then I will adhere on my cute little images to create that fun and cozy scene. And this is a great set. You can make all kinds of different scenes using this stamp set that has just a bunch of great images on there, really cute. And then I here am, I, I am lining up my light so that it will shine behind my fire. And then I just get a little pencil to go around, mark an area where I will want it to be. And then I just put double-sided tape down in there, in that square that I have created, that marking. And then I place my um, light down so that the back is up. So that flat back you see with the writing on it is up. And then I test it out to make sure I have it in the right spot so that it shines behind. And there we go. That's great, perfect setup. And then I am using some double-sided tape here. And my tape is a little bit thin, so I found I had to uh, double it up. So I'm using double thickness. And then I will just adhere that all around on that back side of that panel. So I'm just going to, you know, cut it, cut it down so you're not watching, cut this video down so you're not watching me place it all, all along. But you want it to frame the whole, you see how I have it covered there, but not to, you know, leaving that back of the, of that uh, light free. And there we go. And then I take off, I remove all that backing paper from the, from the uh, tape. And then I place it on an A2, mine's a top folding white A2 card base. And then once I have that down, I again check it out. Look at that. And then I realize I need to have something so that my recipient knows that it's a light up card and where to press on it. So I quickly stamp or ink up and stamp a gift. And that is also in the uh, stamp set, that cozy fireplace stamp set. So I color it up in some purples and then some black for the ribbon or gray. And then what I did was fussy cut it out. And then along the edges where I fussy cut it is white. So I just like to finish it off with a little black to make it look a little more polished and um, give it a little more finished look to it. So you don't see the white edges. And then I have a little push stamp from my stash and I'll push push that on there sorry my head got in the way a little bit so I just use an acrylic block to stamp that on there and then I make sure I am going to adhere it in the correct space so I try it out again put some liquid adhesive on there and boom there it is your card is ready to head out to someone special thank you for visiting don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, come back to see more videos. Thanks again. Bye-bye.